awards that we want to give out. So if you'd like to come a little closer, that'd be great. Um, we're going to start that now. <laughs> Tom, you come Jason. forward. <laughs> He's right there. That's chit chat. Then it's just their chit chat. Get your chair. Put your chair. Go somewhere from there. Slide them over there. Okay, so we have a couple of things that we want uh, awards that we would like to give out. Um, uh, during the course of COVID, we had some retirements, and uh, we never acknowledged them in the way that they should have been. Uh, we had one that uh, pre-COVID, uh, but she didn't really want to do anything and she was still going to work here and there so but we're going to catch up all four of them and then we're also honoring three of our employees who have been with us 30 plus years so the first one i want to talk about is tom <laughs> so tom somerville has been with us 36 years this year <laughs> Tom has worked on the yard that entire time. He's worked hard. He's always been a good, a, a good salesman to our customers. He's always got a smile on his face. He's dependable as the day is long. Doesn't like to take time off. So yeah, I mean, you couldn't ask for a better employee. He's had a lot of uh, varied employees over the years. So <laughs> some good, some bad. So, but uh, through it all, he's he's been there with us. So Tom, we have this plaque for you today. It says, for your dedication, skills, and all the countless hours, the biggest thank you. You are an incredible asset in assisting our customers in the lumber yard. You have contributed to the continued success of our family business in countless ways, and for this we are forever grateful. We are so happy and proud of all you have accomplished. Thank you for staying and growing with us through the years. Thank you. Woo! Yeah. Uh, so our second long timer is Joe Willer. Okay, so Joe has been with us for this year for 35 years, and uh, he has been a mainstay at the front counter. He has bought some expertise and knowledge in the uh, materials that we sell and helping our customers and getting them out the door and helping them with their problems. Um, I think it was Mr. Hewitt that said about um, you know the help that our, our employees do and, and as they um, all of them said, you know, and I should have said it with Tom too, so you know we can't do this without our employees and we've been blessed as a business to have such good employees and who have stayed with us for so long and worked through everything with us. So, Joe says, for your dedication skills and all the countless hours, the biggest thank you. You are an incredible asset in assisting our customers in the sales counter. You have contributed to the continued success of our family business in countless ways, and for this we are forever grateful. We are so happy and proud of you for all you've accomplished. Thank you for staying and growing with us through the years. We'll do your pictures after. Our third longtime employee unfortunately had a family vacation planned for this week. Oh. And that's Julie Thomas. Oh. And she has been, as of December, um, she has been with us for 30 years. Wow. She started when Hillary was a baby and I needed help. <laughs> and um, so she came in in December of, of the year she started. She's been a tremendous asset to our, our store here and with the help with our customers. She has a rapport with our customers that uh, 
just can't be matched up that I can't even do that she does uh, in the way that she can respond to some of them. So she's, she's a wonderful asset, does whatever we ask her to do. And um, we are sorry that she couldn't be here today, but we are most, most grateful to have her as part of our staff. The only difference in hers is you are an incredible asset in insisting in our customers in the office. Otherwise, it says the same thing. So Julie, when you see this, Thank you. <laughs> okay. So, like I said, we had retirements that didn't take place. Um, you know, in, in a in a. Um, environment like this where we can thank our, our people and wish them well on their retirement uh, in front of the entire staff and whoever else would like to be here. So our first one is a member of the family. Unfortunately, she could not be with us today. Her name is Lynn Dyson. Not all of you here know her. She worked here for, she worked here for 31 years. She was a clerk. Um, she came in with uh, knowledge of gardening and, and, and um, lawn and garden and was a tremendous help with us with that so that that was what she brought to the table helped us really grow in that area um, she had a rapport with the customers that just couldn't be beat uh, we still have customers today that still ask about her employees ask about her how she was doing and um, she has been missed and we have wished her well over the years in her retirement her plaque says throughout your 31 year career in your parents business you made an impact on our customers and your co-workers. You were always a welcoming presence to all who entered our doors. Thank you for all you contributed to the growth of the family business. Your hard work, dedication, and dedication has been appreciated by all. Yay. Yay. Our other uh, employee that, in, that retired um, also could not be with us today. Uh, that is our sister-in-law, Marcia Dyson. She is Lee's wife. Uh, she worked in the office. She did accounts payable. Um, unfortunately, when she retired, we were knee-deep in COVID. Um, I wasn't able to be here, and so we were unable to do anything. So we are recognizing her today. Marcia, thank you for your 30 years of dedicated service to our family business. We are thankful for your loyalty and hard work over all the years. May your retirement be filled with endless time to relax and enjoy your hurting children. Woo! Our third retirement is here. Yay! <laughs> Robert. Robert's famous. Robert also retired during the COVID uh, year, and uh, we were unable to have a retirement party for him also. Um, he's been in and out since he retired, and, and we're so glad to see him. Robert started with us um, 41 years ago. Woo! Woo! Straight off the farm. Into our <laughs> so, but, but you know, coming off the farm, he, Robert was very knowledgeable on many, many assets, assets aspects of our business. Thing. Um, you know, when you work on a farm, you have to know how to do this, and you have to know how to do this, and when this breaks down, you got to figure out how to do it. So because of all his years of working on the farm, when he came here, his expertise that he brought with him was amazing. You know, he could, he could figure things out, he could think about it, he knew about plumbing, which is a biggie. <laughs> and he just was an, a very applicable man to have in our employment. He also, over the years, JC, tended to go to auctions, as you all know, and he, he bought back lots of stuff. Well, that was turned out to be Robert's forte. He loved, <laughs> he loved when JC came back with the uh, auction um, products and, um, and junk. <laughs> And <laughs> other people's treasures, that's what it's called. So he loved going through those and putting a price on them, and I, I think we can get this for this, JC. And he was just a wonderful man. You always had a smile on your face, mm -hmm. always glad to be here. We all enjoyed your company. We enjoy that you still come in and see us and still have that smile on your face. So Robert's flag says, 
Thank you for your 41 years of service and dedication to our family business. Your expertise in problem solving helped countless customers and your good nature will be hard to replace. We wish you all the best in your retirement and future plans. Thank you so much. up on each other's stuff, you know, what's going on, and she was looking for a job. Well, well guess what? We were looking for somebody, too. So I said, hey, would you be interested in working in the store? Well, I don't know anything about hardware, but yeah. And I thought, well, you'll learn. You'll learn. And over the years, yes, she did. She learned. And she got very good. She handled the front counter, two registers going at one time, uh, very friendly to our customers that came in, got to learn a lot about our business. And in all, was it just a general good employee who will very, very much be missed. Mm -hmm. <laughs> People still miss you. <laughs> yeah. Linda Slack says, may you be proud of the work you have done, all that you learned, and all the help you were over the years. We are grateful for your years of service and dedication to our family business. We will miss seeing you at the front counter. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you very much. Yay! Yay! Woo! 